with us for many years and know that we are usually with Klesuntite, the big band of Bob Herman and his friends. Those of you who know that we are usually in our beloved sanctuary where we built, we built the space between the ark and the back wall to fit our Torah so we could unroll her and see the whole thing from end to beginning as is our custom. On Simchat Torah to read the very end of Torah when Moses dies, but in the same breath, in the same breath to begin again with Bereshit, with the very first words of Genesis. This is, we call it, Zman Simchatenu. And so even though we don't have what we usually have in so many ways, including on this holy day, we are grateful for what we do have. We have the brothers Lazaroff, Jeff and David, who are bringing their wonderful music and spirit to this space. We have Rabbi James Stone Goodman, who doesn't usually join us on Simchat Torah, but now is going to bring his music and his poetry. Rabbi Daniel, Rabbi Karen, Rabbi Randy, their spirits are definitely here and we would not be doing this without Rabbi Daniel, who is making sure that all of this reaches each and every one of you, for you are all necessary. Randy Smith and her son Tanner and Jacob Talby Goodman and everyone who is helping us today. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for Sukkot. is about both protection and fragility. The Sukkah you see was built for protection in the wilderness. And both words, Sukkah and Skrach, the stuff on the top, both suggest protection and covering. The kind of protection and covering that we need today. The shaded area of the sukkah needs to be greater than the unshaded, but you must still be able to see the stars through the roof, reminding us that no matter how safe we might be, right, we are still vulnerable. Just after these holy days, when we hopefully have come to know what is real, this message of our vulnerability is driven home. What is real? 
not our homes, not our stuff, not the walls that we build. What is real is our relationships. And now something more is added. Creation, creativity, and living in harmony and in peace with the world. For we know there are no walls high enough or strong enough to ultimately protect us. What we must do is make the world safe, to be smart, and find ways to live in the world, all of us together. This is the meaning of these four species, the Lulav and the Etrog that we have been shaking for new growth, for new beginnings, all throughout this holiday. Each one of these species is different. Some have taste, some have no taste, some have smell, some have no smell, but the Etrog has both taste and smell. But you know, the tradition teaches us if we had four Etrogim, it wouldn't make the mitzvah. It would not fulfill the mitzvah. Why? Because we are all necessary. Every one of us. We are all necessary. So... Let this be, in spite of everything, Zman Simchatenu. Let this be a time when we open our hearts to each other, when we pray for healing for the soul of our nation, and when we dare, in this time, to bring each other joy. speak and may the earth hear the words of my mouth oh listen O earth to these words we have been pounded on the peaks who ascends these holy mountains and why we bled all over our backpacks descended at the penultimate moment Snatched away from the precipice, we descended into the valley, where we sat quietly with our eyes closed, waiting for a bus, nothing loftier. And we would have remained there until teachings fell like rain and words descended like dew, spring showers on fresh grass and a storm of wisdom on tender green. Listen, O oh earth. Pay attention to the bleeding sky, brother elements, sister flesh. Pay a little attention. Remember the days of old. 
Deuteronomy blesses me at the end of the Torah. Ye Yisrael, ye Yisrael ve'oraita, Israel and the Torah, and HaKadosh Baruch Hu and the Holy One, they are one. year we sat down with the Torah on industrial tables between us two rows one on each side of the table adults and children we all sat there staring at the Torah drawn towards it the humidity in the air raising an earth smell an animal scent an earth smell an animal scent from the sheepskin scroll laid out between us Call it black fire and white fire. The 
scent of earth, rock, animal. Someone made a joke as we gazed into the scroll. I want to eat it, quoting the psalm, taste and see that God is good. I felt it. If I could have sat there longer, maybe a few more hours, and stared into the scroll, the entire story would have gobbled me up. Adonai HaMevorach Baruch Adonai HaMevorach Leolam Ha'ed Baruch Adonai HaMevorach Leolam Ha'ed Baruch Adonai Yovinu Melech HaOlam Asher Bachar Banu Mikol Amim Natan Lanu Servant of God, Veris Moab al Pi Adonai, by the mouth of God, Vayikbor Oto Vaka by Eris Moab in front, the land of Moab, Mul Beit Por, in front of Beit Por, Vayol Yada Yishet Kivurato, and nobody knows his burial place, Adayom Hazir, till this day. Moshe ben Meav, yes, Rim Shana, he was 120 years old, but Moto, lo ka ha ta no, his eyes were not dear, but his eyes were not dim, but lo na sa la ho, and we cried, when Israel, the children of Israel, from Moshe, be out of old Moab, shloshim yom, for 30 days. When the days of our crying came to an end, David Moshe, Yoshua be noon. Joshua, the son of noon, while the Ruach Ochmai was full of the Spirit of God, Kisamach Moshe, because Moses laid his hands on him, and Yadav Yalav, and Yishmiu Elav, Bene Yisrael. And the children of Israel listened, and they did as God commanded Moses. There has not risen Navi or a prophet since the Israel Moshe, who is like Moses. A 
אשר ידו הולו קד פנים אל פנים מונוגד פייס טה פייס בכל האותות All the signs I'm hoping in the wonders אשר שלחו אדוני וקנסנט לעשות And in doing and in doing בארץ מצרים From the land of Egypt to Pharaoh לכל עבדיו and all the servants there And all the strong arm of the Chol HaMora HaGadol And all the great wonders Asher Asa Moshe That Moshe did L'Yenei Kol Yisrael In front of all the eyes Of the children of Israel Chazak Chazak Renit Chazak Baruch Ata Adonai ולמלך העולם אשר נתן לנו תורת אמת וחיי עולם נטע בתוכנו ברוך אתה אדוני נותן התורה blessed are you giver of the Torah blessed are you giver of the Torah אמן וזאת הברכה This is the blessing. Why Hazot? Zot is the Shekhinah. And so even when Moses could not come, the Shekhinah, she came with us. Moses said, let me, I pray, cross over and see the good land on the other side of the Jordan, that good hill country and the Lebanon. Moses, he almost died 10 times in the wilderness. At the end of 40 years, he stood on Mount Nebo, Har Nebo, gazing into the distance, arguing his case. He so wanted to go into the land. He climbed Mount Nebo across from the Jordan, and there God showed him the whole thing and said to him, this is the land. You can see it. But you will not cross over into it. The Batkol, the Shekhinah, Zot, the Divine Voice said, The time has come for you to depart from the world. And so he drew a circle around himself and said, Master of the Universe, I will not leave this place until you rescind the decree. He wrapped himself in a sackcloth spread ashes on his head, howled the prayers until the heavens and earth were shaken. God said to the angels, lock all the gates. But his prayer was like a sword, ripping and tearing. He pleaded with God, is this my reward? Again, a divine voice came and said, don't be afraid. I myself will attend to you and your burial. Still, he begged the heavens and the earth. He went to the stars and the planets, the mountains and the hills. He went to the sea. He went to the great angel. He lifted both his hands, placed them over his heart. Behold, the end of flesh and blood. He rose and washed his hands and feet and became as pure as an angel from the highest of heavens. And the Holy One came down to take his soul. And with God, the three angels, Michael, Gabriel, Zag Zagel. Then the Holy One said to Moses, close your eyes. And he did. He closed his eyes. Put your arms over your chest. He put his arms over his chest. Bring your legs together. And he brought his legs together. And then God took his soul. Saying, my daughter, the time is fixed. 120 years now, your time to depart has come. Do not delay. And God said, I will take you to the highest heaven and will set you under the throne of glory next to the angels. And in that instant, the Holy One kissed him. his soul with a kiss and there he died there in Moab 
God buried him in the valley opposite Beit Peor. No one knows his precise burial place to this day, but he was 120 years old when he dies, and his eyes were not weak, nor his strength gone. Oh, how we grieved for him in the plains of Moab for 30 days, until the time of weeping and mourning was over. For this the end. And this the beginning. Baruch et Adonai Hamavorach, Baruch Adonai Hamavorach, Le'olam Ba'el, Baruch et Adonai, Be'ilu Melech HaOlam, Asher Bachar Banu, Mikol Amin, Benatan Manu, Et Torato, Baruch et Adonai, Notin HaTorah, Blessed are you, giver of the Torah, Bereshit bara Elohim in the beginning God created it Hashemayim v'etaretz the heavens and the earth v'haaretz and the earth haytatohu vavohu was unformed and empty v'choshech and darkness v'choshech darkness alpinate a home over the face of the deep v'ruach Elohim and the Spirit of God. Mirach Efet hovered Al Pene Hamayim over the face of the waters. Vayomer Elohim Yihior, and God said, Let there be light. Vayihior Vayar Elohim et Aor Kitov, and God saw that the light it was good. Vayadel Elohim, and God Distinguish between or between choshech between light and between darkness. Vayikra Elohim laor yom and God called the day the light day. Ula choshech or alayla and God called the darkness night. Vayere vayivoker vayere vayivoker and it was evening and it was morning. Vayere vayivoker day one. Baruch atah Adonai Ruinu melech haolam Asher natan lanu Torah temet 
Beginning and end. It's a cycle, it's a spiral, a circle, ascend with ending. Begin with Genesis. End, imply beginning, beginning, a seam. S E A M to the end. Self devouring serpent, Uroboros, first living being by Plato. By Ben Bagbag, turn it and turn it, everything contained within. Ben Bagbag, who knew the chambers of the Torah, Hafochba, the Hafochba, the Cholaba, this life force, a point existing within, sign of divine origin, partners in creation, Hachayot, Shemichaye, Choldavar, Haadam Hadibuk, Venukada, the human being that connects to this point, Venukuda Ze, to this point. Partners in creation, every living thing, every living thing bonded to this point. Every living thing. After we read the Torah, the gates are wide open. We pray for healing, healing of the spirit and the healing of the body. For those we know, for those we don't know. Take somebody into your heart and pray for the healing, the healing of the spirit and the healing of the body. Take it deep. The healing of the spirit. Healing of the body for those we know, for those we don't know. On my right, the angel Michael, on my left, the angel Gabriel. In front of me, the angel Uriel, behind me, the angel Raphael, above my head, above my head, above my head. Shekhinah Teel. Michael, who is like God, Gabriel, God is my strength, Uriel, Uriel, God is my light, Raphael, God is my healer, above my head, above my head, above my head, above my head, above my head. Baruch atah Adonai, Rofei Acholim, blessed are you, great healer.
Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom. Shabbos of peace and of be soul, more soul, and soul. Shabbat Vayina Fash. To Shabbat and to re soul Vayina Fash. The Shamaru Vene Israel. Et a Shabbat, et a Shabbat, la sot et a Shabbat, le doro tamberito lam, veni u ven bene Israel, hot he le olam, hot he le olam, ki sheshet yami masadona. Et a shamayim et a retz Uva yom hashvi Shavad vayina hafash Shavad vayina hafash Shavad vayina hafash The children of Israel shall keep the Shabbos Observing it in every generation It is a sign, it is a sign forever between me and the people of Israel. For in six days, the Eternal One made the heavens and the earth, and on the seventh day, God rested. Vahinafash, God breathed the soul into creation. Vahinafash, God breathed the soul into creation. We will rejoice. Even though we know that no fragile sukkah can keep us safe in these in uncertain times, there is another teaching about the sukkah and about this time of Simchat Torah and Shabbat. It refers to the language of seeing, really seeing in a conscious way. It comes from a teaching about Sarah. Sarah was called Yisacha. The commentator Rashi says it's because she perceived the Ruach HaKodesh. She knew when she was not alone. She knew the, the Holy Spirit, the Shekhinah, right? 
the zot of zota bracha she knew she knew that no matter how dark things were there was that pintala light there was that spark of light that all we needed to do everything we needed was in that spark of light so there are two senses of the word you see one is covering and concealment but the other of suka it's vision and seeing is this a contradiction no because in order to perceive what we need to see and to know and to understand something of everything has to be a little bit concealed god says you shall not see me and live but we know we do see so the covering the protection makes vision makes perception possible and only when godliness is veiled is covered in a garment can we perceive the godliness of it the garment of story the garment of poetry the garment of song the garment of music the garment of torah is how we perceive godliness so there need not be a contradiction between concealment and vision on the contrary there is no vision without a certain concealment so there may be many things that seem contradictory that may be possible we just have to learn to see the beauty in whatever covering is making the essence visible to us Samachta vechagecha, raita hach samea, ai 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 Samachta bechagecha, raita achzamea, ai, 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 Connects with it. Ke Yisrael, mi piel, mi piel, yevorach Yisrael, mi piel, mi piel, yevorach Yisrael. Ein adir 
to do, we offer it to healing, praises, psalms, songs, poetry, for it is said that these are the psalms that draw holiness into the world. These are the psalms, these are the songs, this is the creativity that draws the Shekhinah because she cannot bear to be without us when we are at our best. So, hallelujah, let's draw that Shekhinah. Let us draw her into creation. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. hallelujah. Oh, the breath of every living thing. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. It's said that in the Sukkah, Adonai and Yahweh, you know, hallelujah. the name and the euphemism. Yud He Vav He. If you add up the letters of Yud He Vav He and Adonai, you get 91, and that is the Sukkah, the Gematria of Sukkah as well. But now we won't have the Sukkah to remind us that we need to bring those upper and lower worlds together all of the time. It is our work. It is our work to lift up the ordinary and make it holy. To praise with everything that we have. Hallelujah. Oh, the breath of every living thing. Hallelujah. If our mouths were as full of song as the sea, then our tongues could sing like the waves, and our lips express like the sky. And our eyes flash with the light of the sun and the moon And our hands spread forth like the eagles of heaven And our feet, and our feet as swift as deer Oh, the breath of every living thing The breath of every living thing Hallelujah, hallelujah Hallelujah. Oh, praise God for the place, for the, for the actions, for the deeds, for the goodness and the greatness. Oh, hallelujah. take a shofar. Hallelujah, with with drums and dancing. Hallelujah, with the oud and the flute. Hallelujah, 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 but sealed Hallelujah, and the Shama Alleluia. Let everything that breathes thank and praise God. Ha ha Alleluia. Alleluia. Alleluia.
and the lower worlds, the heavens and the earth are so close they kiss. That the way the world is supposed to be is closer to the way that it is. Let us not lose that light, that hope, our ability to praise all that is good, all that is possible. Following this service, you'll find a Zoom link to enter into the Yisker service It'll be on our website maybe that's the easiest place to find it we'll go right into Yisker after this service but know that we have this Shabbat tonight we'll make Abdallah and our holy days will be over for this season but we'll always have the moon the new moon the full moon Shabbat before we blink an eye, just when we need it most at the darkest time of the year, we will have Hanukkah. Hanukkah that dares us, dares us to make lights in the darkness, to believe in miracles when they don't seem possible. I can't even begin to imagine what the world will look like then. I'm hoping it will be Closer to healing, closer to what we have hoped for during these holy days, a good year, a healthier year, and a year that brings us closer to peace. Say it with me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Draw in the Shekhinah every chance you get. Alleluia. Grow that light in your soul. Alleluia. And God willing, we will find ourselves Alleluia. in this year of 5781. In spite of everything. Alleluia. Closer to peace Alleluia. and justice.